of the Goodwill Challenge. I can't even believe that I'm saying that, but it is the summer edition, and I'm so excited to be sharing with you what I found to sort of perk up our daughter's future big girl room. This is sort of a transitional space right now, but I did find a couple great things at Goodwill to add some life to her room. So the first thing I found was a Ralph Lauren bed sheet in twin size, which is perfect for her big girl bed. It was in fantastic condition, and I didn't really have a vision for this room, so I just went with, you know, the red and white stripes and it's really cute for right now. And then I added in some other red touches with these adorable strawberries that I got for only 50 cents. They were a really cute find and add again just a little touch of whimsy and a little bit of red into her room. But it's funny because since finding these things, I actually um, sort of put together more of a vision of what I want for this room so things will change and I was able to score an amazing deal on Pottery Barn Kids over the weekend so her room will have more um, pink and peach and touches of yellow and green more going in that direction again it's a transitional space and this is how it looks right now so I hope you guys enjoy so here is Evie's big girl room as of right now. Again, this is all subject to change. I added in a white blanket and then this little pillow, which is sort of like a pinky kind of reddish color and um, it has white in the background. And then I just love red and navy, so I popped some navy pillows and then some two neutral pillows in the back. And then also to make it a little bit more girly, I have this little um, hamper basket type thing that my sister got her for her birthday. So it is blue, but it has little hearts all over it. It's really cute. Right now it's just holding an Olaf blanket, but it will be put to better use when this room becomes more of a permanent spot for her. On this little side table over here, which was actually a hand-me-down for my sister, she found it on the side of the road, and then she kept it for a little while, and then she was cleaning out her house because she's having a baby, so she handed it down to me, and it fits in this space perfectly. I absolutely love it, and again, it adds just a little bit more of a girly touch with like the scalloped edges and everything. So you can see I just have some cute little things displayed. We do read books in here, and she still plays in here sometimes, and then up here I have my strawberries. So I popped them in a little mercury glass container that you guys know I had already on hand, and I just love how cute they are, and I thought it was so perfect to pair these with one of her favorite books, which is The Little Mouse, Red Ripe Strawberry, and The Big Hungry Bear. So I thought it was perfect, sort of like an object lesson for her. I mean, obviously we eat strawberries all the time, but she could play with these while we're reading the book. We can count them, we could sort them, all sorts of fun activities that could happen with these strawberries. And again, only 50 cents, totally awesome. So I hope you guys enjoyed seeing what I was able to come up with for way less than $5. I am so excited to go and watch all of your videos so please, please, please leave me a link down below or just say I did the challenge and I will go over and check it out and then add you to my list of uh, participants uh, down in my description bar so we can all go and see each other's videos. So thanks so much for watching and I'll be talking to you soon. Bye!